Hello friend, now we learn the chamfer, round and shell command. So first draw the any one part. So select the file, new, part and ok. Now select the extrude, placement, define, sketch plane and sketch. And sketch the part. OK. Now apply the thickness. OK. Now if you want to chamfer at the edges of this part. So first select the chamfer with this tool and you can also select the chamfer with this type. OK. Now select the chamfer and then you can see this type of different different dimension. D cross D means dimension both the side X and Y are same. So you can apply only one dimension. D1 cross D2 means you can apply the X and Y dimension different different. Angle cross D means you can standard angle apply over here and distance. 45 cross D means 45 degree set automatic and distance value you can apply. Now you can select the anyone and then select the edges where you want to apply the chamfer. You can select the different different edges with the help of a control ok now you can apply the distance and press ok you can see the chamfer ok this is the simple tool of the chamfer now you want to round the edges of this part so select the round and you can also select the round in an insert menu. Ok. This define the set. In a set you can see the radius and reference. In a reference means edges where you want to apply the round. So first select the any one edges. Ok. Now this define the 15 radius. If you want to apply the radius over here and over here different different. Please select the radius and you can apply the radius. You can modify the radius over here. Okay. If you want to another add a radius at the center. So you can also select the add radius and please pick up and drag it where you want to require and you can modify the dimension ok and you can press the ok now you can see the radius ok to understand the cell command we can draw the another part so open a new part revolve placement define front and sketch draw the geometry center line and press ok now you can see the this is the total solid now we can apply the cell so please select cell 
and you can also select the cell in the insert apply the thickness okay now you can select the any one surface to open this is so this selected surface is removed from this material and okay now you can easily see the this is the hollow okay thank you